Hey Libra, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nali, aka Owl Tarot. I'm here to give you guys a weekend love reading. We're going to tap into this energy, see what messages are coming towards you guys this weekend, and what is the possible outcome here. Guys, before we get started, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically, and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, my readings are timeless general love readings. Um, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does. Leave the rest behind. Time is fluid. So whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. If the reading resonating, you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The info is in the description box below. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. Alrighty, guys. So we're going to go ahead and get started here. I went ahead and I pulled out your oracle. The overall energy for your guys' reading is a new love and retreat, okay? A new person has stirred the rom your romantic feelings and retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. So you may be meeting someone who definitely likes to travel, possibly, or you may have already met someone who likes to travel. But there's an energy about you and this person just spending a lot of time together, okay? Um, just kind of isolating yourself from other friends and family, really, really getting to know each other. The next oracle that I got was a sunshine, good vibes, happy times, positive attitude, things going well. The answer is yes, and Mr. or Mrs. Fix It. Don't try to fix others. Heal yourself to attract best partners, people pleasing. Trust the process. I feel that this was you in the past, okay? Libra, in the past, you met people that... In, in reality, in the exterior, this person seemed to be really good. Everything was fine mentally, physically, and emotionally. And as you got to know the, these people, you ended up finding out that there was something wrong with them. Either they were betrayed by other people, so now they don't have trust with, with women or men. Or, you know, this person's childhood was a real fucked up childhood, so now they take it on their adulthood. So there was things that you started finding out about this individual. But I'm really getting here is that you have met somebody new, okay? And you're really doing that work where you're wanting to get to know this person. You're wanting to really know who you're dealing with before you bring this person around your friends and your family. You've done it before when you've brought in people into your life. And you've presented them to your family and friends. And then I don't know where you're like, oh, well, they, I couldn't be with them because of so-and-so. So this time around, you're taking your time with this new love and you're really getting to know this individual. The lovers and judication. So yeah, it's before you make any final decisions here in presenting this person to your family and friends. I feel that you will be taking your time to really get to know this individual. You will be taking your time to um find out what this person really is about or what they're up to and with the lovers here i do see um a soulmate energy between you and this individual and i feel that this is why you're doing it this way this time around because to you you feel like you have met a soulmate like you met somebody that is worth bringing around your friends and family and the final oracle i got here is the vast universe and great achievements okay so your ultimate goal first and foremost is to be in a healthy abundant relationship okay um after all the turmoil that you have been through in these past couple months possibly even years okay um you finally feel like a universe is shining on you universe is finally bringing you the person that you that you deserve or deserves you a person that's going to respect you and put you on that pedestal that you deserve to be on and vice versa the feeling between you and this individual will be mutual and it's like you're trying to achieve not the perfect relationship but the perfect relationship to you meaning respect love equal give and take you know what i mean so i feel that finally you are in this energy where you're starting to achieve that but before you bring that person into your personal circle into your family circle you are going to be taking that time this time around and really get to know this individual okay but this is new love for for those of my libras who i am um this reading is resonating for this is totally new love this is not a next coming back around this is just a new love already this is the person that you have been hoping for praying for I just heard right now, Spirit said, it's because you did the work. So you actually took your time before you went out to meet anyone else. And you really did the healing process of your your end of the bargain, your end of the work, okay? And you've finally been able to, you know, get past whatever in the world you were going through in the, in the past. And now you're starting to come out. And the people that you're attracting are people that are going to be like-minded like you. You're no longer broken. 
you're no longer jaded or you're no longer um you know in this a negative mindset now that you've you've overcome all of those situations you're attracting someone that is in your same energy here so we're gonna go ahead and get started with the tarot here let's see what tarot has to say for you libra universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians please help me give <coughs> excuse me libra please help me give libra clear and concise messages regarding their weekend here what is going on this weekend with libra so i got the two of cups here guys with the prince of cups so definitely new love okay new love a soulmate energy this seems this really feels like it's a new a new relationship for me here okay um something fresh something new something beautiful and i feel that this time around libra you are gonna take your time to really get to know this person you're not at that point in your life anymore where you really got that time to waste on trying to fix somebody else and their past childhood traumas you're at the point where you know you're not trying to have any any lies come in you really want truth and clarity you want that type of connection that you can trust that individual and you don't have to do this um this this inspector gadget role where you got to find out is this true is this person lying to me or what's going on with this person six of cups as i told you this feels like a soulmate energy here okay again i don't i'm not getting i'm getting very strong vibes of this being a new connection this is not a reconciliation this person that's coming into your life is new love but they feel like a soulmate they feel like you've known them your whole life what else universe for my Libra here? This is a lot of water too, Libra. I'm not going to lie. So I'm getting a lot of water here. Um, Queen of Pentacles. You may be dealing with an earth sign here, but there's going to be a lot of emotion between you and this person. I feel that this person that's coming in is very caring, very nurturing, um, somebody that's very stable, somebody that knows what they want in life. But before you bring that person around, you are going to take your time to really get to meet them, get to know them for who they are. What else, universe, for my Libra here? Ten of Swords. So the ending of painful cycles. And this is something that you have ascended from with the High Priestess, okay? You have been through a lot in the recent past. The people that you have dealt with have put you through so many loops and holes. And, and it's like you were jumping constantly through a ring of fire. And I feel that this time around, you're really taking your time. You manifested the person that you want in your life. You're no longer leaving it to fate anymore. You have mastered that energy where you want to manifest a specific person to be a specific way. And you have done the work and you have actually manifested that individual in your life. And as you have done done that you're also going to take the necessary steps to learn who this person really is to spend some one-on-one -on -one time with this person before you make any type of decisions of bringing this person around your friends and, and your family okay so this time around this isn't a relationship like it used to be in the past where you got to meet someone and you were hoping and praying that there was going to be some growth in the situation no this time around you have taken control of your love life you know what you want and that's exactly what you're going to get what are the final messages here for my Libra universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians? Final messages, please. So let's see here. Yep, Seven of Swords and Prince of Pentacles with the Empress at the bottom of the deck. So guys, you do not want to deal. You, you have been very, very clear with universe. You have been very, very clear with your manifestations. Your, your scripting, your prayers, whatever it is that you did, you have been very clear. I am not going to deal with no immature, no good for nothing, lazy ass individual who is broke. I'm not going to be dealing with those individuals that come into my life and run out of my life just when they receive whatever it is that they need. I am done with those type of people. I am looking for an empress. I am looking for an emperor. I am looking for someone to come in and speak truth, speak clarity, someone that doesn't run away from the connection, someone with the eight of wands that comes in and there is a lot of communication between me and this person, a lot of spark between me and this person. And with the tower moment, a person that comes in for good not for bad okay you have been very specific with your manifestations again queen of cups here i feel that you may be dealing with the water sign in the very near future you may be meeting a water sign this weekend but there is a lot of love in this situation there's going to be a lot of love there's going to be a lot of stability between you and this individual queen of pentacles queen of cups energy okay mutual understanding mutual love mutual respect 
this seems to be finally that 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 type of uh person that you have always dreamed for the person that you've always wanted a life with is actually coming towards you and the reason is libra is because you did the work so finally your happiness is on its way all right libra i hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed please don't forget to like share subscribe click that notification bell and if you want to book a personal reading the info is in the description box below i'll talk to you guys soon take care bye